Yo, wait, I'm curious, I'm trying to capture Kotor. Okay, it works, it works! Holy shit, it works! Uh, you have to excuse me a lot because I don't fucking know where I am in this game. But this is first time when I make PC fucking run it on decent frame rate for recording. Look, I have frame rates. Okay, we are in this fucking stupid academy or something. I don't fucking know where. It is. I'm sprinting this game. This is Kotor 2. Jedi are high, I believe. Yeah. Find Abel, so. I don't care. This is modded. All this shit is modded. This is repurposed location of other Jedi garbage. Thank you, Kreia. Hey Kreia, did you see that? You spawned some, some bullshit. Honestly, that was weak. You should... Uh, like... Okay. You told me I can access archive, but that means computer? Force technique, force... Fo Is this some power creep bullshit? Okay, I learned few powers, but... Yeah, force resistance... Unknown force power... Why do I see this? Wait, does it learn me infinitely? What? Uh, that's OP. Why? Holy shit, what a fucking power creep. Oh yeah, that's garbage. So if I learn some particular powers, I cannot fucking obtain them here, but here you can obtain this fucking particular powers for free. That's so fucking disgusting. Not only is it incredibly metagamey min-maxing bullshit power creep trash, I normally don't mind when it's like... I can kill them and get fucking XP. Mm -hmm. Sorry. Why not? Oh, 
Z give XP, right? Wait, I can infinitely spam here fucking enemies to fight? It can also dispawn enemy. It can also fucking give reward. I mean that's XP. Also, where the fuck is Kreia? I had companions. I don't think we need to worry about this. I I swear I had companions for fuck's sake. What the fuck is wrong with this game? Okay, I know it's modded location, I will try to be less harsh, okay? Kreia, can we infinitely spawn me my myself and... Oh, okay, my companions are taken out when I enter training, that's my fucking sense. It's still infinite XP loop. <sighs> okay, so... Uh, there is infinite XP loop without this mod, so... I'm not saying it's fine, I'm just saying it's less fucking problematic. Fucking where I'm going? Where the fuck am I? Okay, I think I'm going in there. Actually, we can fucking circle this place. This is modded location, so there is not much dialogue. I mean, there is dialogue without voice. What? Huh? I'm glad there is somebody, even droid. Look, Ray, I love doors. I, I can teach you how to do that. You can use computers. I knew it. So when I have Kreia with party and I defeat Garbage... Oh fuck, seven fucking lightsabers, of course there is. Oh fucking core 7000 crystal. I, I fucking can't. Okay, so if you cannot fucking play this game, I think you install mods then. Holy shit, you, you have no fucking idea how early you can go here. I, for a moment I get re retorted in my brain and I was thinking they, they are called... Uh, they are called Master Critical Strike. This is a bug from the fucking mod. Uh, uh, on defense, uh, they just placed it here and they didn't probably test it too much. Wait a fucking moment. Did I get a fucking armband? Oh fucking course I get armband. The fuck is my level? Level up. Well, infinite level loop already provided an option. I don't know what to tell you. This is my de no, this dexterity is fine. We should train something like wisdom or fucking strength. Dexterity is max. Constitution is max. Let's train real skills. Okay, what do we have here? Persuade, awareness, repair, threat, injury.
Is this a good idea? I think no. I think we need this. Uh, doing demo. Hmm. We can wait with demo. Okay, what what powers we have? We have double swords. Where are double swords more? This. Thank you. Okay, and now I don't need to learn any basic powers that would help me. I can just fucking get this garbage. Force push. The force push might be good. Like, so far I'm not very pleased by this fucking mod. I think it's too much power creep and too early. I uh, unironically installed the mod because I was hoping for more content. By content I mean explore new location, maybe find new Dark Jedi's who will have any personality, maybe find some archives with well integrated Kotor lore. With you know this old canon. Well... Uh, no. I'm not saying it's trash, but... It's so fucking cheap. Like... I enter here, literally people let me go because I'm Jedi and they put them in the mod just to show that they're getting killed. Which would be fine in itself. But then nobody else is getting killed, there is no more content, no more intrigue. You find two guys getting killed, then you are assassinated and then you are fucking chased by some garbage guys. Yeah, this is this council entrance here. Yeah. This looks suspicious. I wasn't here for some reason or I didn't lose this chest. Hey, we can go out. Let's save, so... This is called Kursant. Okay, so if you ask me, Kursant, but this mod isn't very good. It's great if you wanna be ultra powerful Jedi with no effort. But... I mean, I don't mind it. You know, it's not like game is hard. It's just very cheap. I don't feel like anything here is earned. And worst offender of all, there is like not not good enough lore integration, so you just fucking explore copy paste space with new loot that is insane. Especially for low level I got here. Okay, so uh, uh, okay, I looted. Okay, open a chest is just is just to confuse you. It's like custom mesh, made intentionally, f or at least edited intentionally for HR this expansion, or it's somewhere else in the game too. And I was thinking I need to open all of them to so they will remain open for some reason when they are empty. Uh, I don't know my brain. I didn't play it for very long. I know I quit the game last time here, not because I was so fucking offended by the content or something. Like 
It's rather because... Like, I'm not a fan. So there is Droid Planet. I am one of the very few defenders of Droid Planet, maybe. I hate this DLC. So it's not like it's great or anything, but I am at least able to point out that it's at least good try. It integrates Droid Planet pretty well to the story, as much as you can consider such a early scrap. It doesn't fit well, don't get me wrong. But it's very, very ambitious and inspiring. It's as ambitious as a restoration project that is glorified by everyone. Uh, but less good. Because what you restore, that should be in the game, and is much fucking... I, I cannot fucking have a price and the restoration project, because I played Kotor Withouted once, or maybe even twice. Ending was fast. I wasn't even... Okay, just to be fair, Withhold Restoration Project game was kind of quicker and have better pacing. Unironically have better pacing. Because you didn't do so much busy work, because... You know, uh, what developers consider to be moderate strength Jedi for me is a chore, for example. Okay, glad to see you guys alive. I saw a cutscene where you die, so I wasn't sure if you will be alive or not. This is non this is fucking garbage because this is Narshada. You know this is Narshada, but fucking wars with slight fucking changes. And you know they could not crop off parts of the map. It's full Narshada. And they just lock the doors. <laughs> Look, there you have this cantina where you race. Uh... <sighs> yeah, Kurasan DLC. I'm very sorry, guys. I know you tried. I'm not saying it's. Com what the f why I'm here? Okay, looks like I, it's not the end of being disappointed because I should not be here normally when you enter Ebon Hawk. Don't get me wrong, that's nice. And if that will be consistent for every single time, every single planet, I will be in for that. Maybe that was their intention to show that they can provide something useful. And instead of making like standalone mod that you know, entering Ebon Hawk teleport you to cockpit to unless something, uh, unless some event happens. I would fucking love it. Sadly, they did it exclusively for this DLC. Uh, the D DLC mod DLC, you know, yeah, it's best we have. And it's as I hyperbolized. Overall, mod is not terrible, it's just. Why I get so much fucking cheap power out of nowhere? You you know how hard I have to work for one lightsaber? Why do I have so many now? Holy fucking hell, like, dude. Like, Dark Malak and Dark Raven lights, of course I have them. Okay, so I'm level like 24 and I'm min-maxing like crazy. Normally you would be level 16 here, maybe 17. So, yeah, if I can complain, no, this is not for me. I mean, I will naturally take this fucking power, some of them are very rare crystals, and I will use them like I would get them fairly, but it's fucking cheap. I, I don't mind cheating, we we all use fucking also skipper at fucking start of the game, uh, because fucking uh, developers of... Uh, this uh, restoration project give it here and we sc save scam for it. Uh. But yeah, it's too cheap. Guys, you need to make player earn power and give him power as, uh, you know, form of reward for doing something, not reward for fucking walking to streets. And that will be it and have a good day.